My name is William Dopman, two P's and two N's, P's, <coughs> P's is in popcorn, N is in Nancy Dopman, and uh, uh, I flew down from Port Townsend, Washington State, and uh, that's where uh, my wife and I live presently. So, uh, and before that, I, well, I was at UT, uh, it's a rather famous school, uh, not too far from here, and uh, I taught there for six years. You know, I started when I was five, and uh, some, I don't know that there was even recorded history back that long ago. I wanted to, to play the piano because I saw somebody do it uh, who was very good, and that person's name was uh, a pianist by the name of Joseph Levine. And uh, you know, I heard him play, and I thought it was pretty cool. And so I, um, I, I bugged my parents for uh, piano lessons, and uh, my father, who had you know, was not a professional musician, he was an insurance accountant, he used to take uh, lessons from the same teacher as I did. And uh, he would have his lesson after me, and then I'd wait for him, and then we'd go home. So that's the way it was, that's how I got started. When I was in high school and junior high, I, I, I was attracted to the uh, magical arts. I learned how to be a, a magician. <clears throat> I was a teenage ma magician. <laughs> and, uh, and so I, I learned how to, how, how to work out a pattern, you know, how, how to talk in front of, of people. And playing the piano is, uh, is another way of uh, communicating uh, without words. But the words always come tumbling in somewhere along the line. We can't play music without talking about it. It's a very strange phenomenon if you look at it. But words are always just around the corner. So that's where I like to be able to uh, uh, pluck them from. <laughs> 